Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of DP Outdoors. Today we are going over a common Ford problem, which that's called the brake lamp bulb fault. And whenever you have this problem, it will pop up on your little menu here on your dash. And what it is, your back tail light is a dual filament light bulb, which means one filament works for your brakes and the yellow filament works for your running light. Now this issue, your running light will work, but your brake light filament will not work. Therefore, each time you press the brake, the brake light will not come on. I'm gonna show you guys an easy way of fixing this with only a pair of pliers. All right, in order to fix the problem, you're gonna to have to replace the bulb. Now that's actually very, very simple, something you can do by yourself. I'm gonna go over the steps before I show you guys in the video. First, right, you're going to want to pop the trunk. Now inside, you will see this little panel right here. And you're going to want to take that off, which will give you access to the back of the tail light, which I will show you now. Again, you don't need any special tools for this. All I did there is use my hands, but this is what it should look like after that panel is removed. You should see, there you are, those little guys right there. There's two, one on the bottom left, and then one right above the spring. You're going to want to loosen those up with any type of pair of pliers. You won't be able to do it with your fingers, though. Alright guys, once you remove those two black screws and the bolts in the back, the tail light will just pop right off. Alright, once your tail light's popped off, just like so, we will be removing that brown cylinder. So if I hold the camera out, that's what the back of the light looks like. We're going to remove the housing right by the blue circle. Alrighty, once that's been removed, this is what it'll look like. It just twists and pulls straight out, but that's your bulb right there. You go ahead and just pull the bulb out. Alright guys, here's the old bulb next to the new ones. This is a 2014 Ford Focus LE, and on those, you're going to want the 3157, or I believe the 3157K works as well. But as you can see on this old bulb, I don't know if it will show on the camera or not, but it is actually burnt out on that end that's closest to you right now. It's like black. It's hard to see on the camera. But anyways, so those are the new ones we'll be putting in. And it will just click right in. And that's after it's been replaced, and we'll shove it right back in there. Which it only goes in one way, as you can see the notches will line up with the notches on the side of the housing. Alright, let me just show you how easy this is to put in, same way as pulling it out. You line the notches up, push it in, and then turn it. It's that simple. Alright everybody, after your headlight is pushed back in place, it's time just to put those two black bolts that you unscrewed, plastic bolts that you unscrewed, it's time to put those back on. First, you're going to want to hand tighten it as tight as you can. Thank you. 
and then you're going to use your pliers and tighten them back up. And of course your last step is going to be putting the cover back on. Very simple. At the top portion of it, you will seize a longer tab. And that can only go right there. So you just put that in place. And I push down. And it's you're ready to go. Alright, we are back in the car and we're gonna do a test to make sure that what we did fixed the issue. If it did, the notification should not pop up. So we're gonna go ahead and start the car now. And look at that, we are good to go. So this is how you fix that problem of the brake lamp bulb fault. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. This is my first how-to video. I'm hoping to do a lot more in the near future. If you have any uh, requests, please let me know. As always, you guys have a great day.